TLC versus Spice Girls in the 1990s. Don't get me wrong. You know, I'm a guy. You know, TLC, I, I like Spice Girls. They made a couple good music, but they were, it was too white. The music was weird. It was too too whitewashed. You know, then you got the token black girl, which was, and then they gonna call the black girl scary. You know, and that's insulting. You know, scary. And Mel B was the only black girl. She, but she fitted in with the girls, white girls. You know, she they were they she she didn't say they were racist. She, she said they, they they treated her just like they were sisters. They didn't even look at her race. They never they never made fun of her skin color. They they, they never you know she was mixed. I think she's half white, half black. But she's still considered black. Her she's darker than the other girl, so she's still you know considered black, you know. But um, TLC music, I just love TLC music because they were just something different. We never there aren't too many black female artists besides you know Destiny's Child came out. Destiny's Child came out about ninety eight, and they were competition for TLC. They were younger, you know, and um. It was just so much, though. But Spice Girls, music was a little bit eccentric. Yeah, I didn't really... Look. I mean, they had a couple good songs. If you want to be my lover, you got to be with my friend. Making it last forever. Friendship always lasts. Uh, you know, they did a couple good songs, but nothing like TLC. TLC was... they. Those girls were hardworking. They spent most of their time... They didn't They didn't even have kids. They were just... Oh, they were so busy doing what they were doing. Working hard. Making music. And I admire that.